Tablet Coating Introduction Coated tablets are defined as tablets covered with one or more layers of mixture of various substances such as natural or synthetic resins, gums, inactive and it's insoluble filler, sugar, plasticizer, polyhydric alcohol, waxes, authorized coloring material, and sometimes flavoring material. Therapy Avoid irritation of esophagus and stomach. Avoid bad taste. Avoid inactivation of drug in the stomach. Improve drug effectiveness. Prolong dosing interval. Improve dosing interval. Improve patient compliance. Aspects of tablet coating. Aspects of tablet coating. 2. Technology. Reduce influence of moisture. Avoid dust formation. Reduce influence of atmosphere. Improve drug stability. Prolong shelf life. Tablet coating is the application of coating composition to moving bed of tablets with concurrent use of heated air to facilitate evaporation of solvent. Basic principle of tablet coating. Type of tablet coating. Sugar coating. Film coating. Enteric coating. Controlled release coating. Specialized coating. Compressed coating. Electrostatic coating. Dip coating. Vacuum film coating. Equipments for tablet coating. Standard. Conventional coating pan. Perforated coating pan. Fluidized bed air suspension coater. Immersion sort system. Immersion tube system. Axle cotter system. Pellegrini pan system. Dryer coater system. Glad coater system. High coater systems. Air suspension system. Standard coating pan. It consists of a circular metal pan mounted somewhat angularly on a stand. The pan is 8 to 60 inches in diameter and is rotated on its horizontal axis by a mortar. Heated air is directed into the pan and onto the tablet bed and exhausted means of ducts positioned through the front of the pan. Coating solutions are applied by ladling or spraying the material onto the tablet bed. Use of the atomizing systems to spray the liquid coating material onto the tablets produces a faster, more even distribution of the solution or suspension. Standard Coating Pan Immersion Tube System With this system, a tube is immersed in the tablet bed. The tube delivers heated air and a spray nozzle is built in the tip of the tube. Coating solution is applied simultaneously with the heated air from the immersed tube. The drying air flows upward and is exhausted by a conventional duct. Immersion Tube System Glatt Immersion Sod System In this system, drying air is introduced through a perforated metal sod device that is immersed in the tablet bed. The drying air flows upward from the sword through the tablet bed. Since the air is more intimately mixed with the wetter tablets, a more efficient drying environment is provided. Coating solutions are applied by an atomized spray system directed to the surface of the rotating tablet bed. Glatt Immersion Sod System Pellegrini Pan System The first coating pan rotating on a horizontal axis equipped with tapered side walls and an integral baffle system. It has a baffle pan and a diffuser that distributes the drying air uniformly over the tablet surface. Perforated Pan Systems These equipments consist of perforated or partially perforated drums that are rotated on their horizontal axis in an enclosed housing. In both systems drying air is directed into the drum, is passed through the tablet bed and is exhausted through the perforations in the drum. Perforated Pans Axle Cotter System High Cotter System it introduces drying air through hollow perforated ribs located on the inside periphery of the drum. The ribs dip into the bed as the pan rotates. Drying air passes up and fluidizes the tablet bed. Exhaust is from the back of the pan. Drear coater pan. Glad coater. The glad coater is the latest perforated pan coater to be introduced in the industry. In the glad coater, Drying air can be directed from inside the drum through the tablet bed and out an exhaust duct. Alternatively, with an optional split-chambered plenum, 
drying air can be directed in the reverse manner up through the drum perforations for partial fluidization of the tablet bed. Several airflow configurations are possible. Fluid bed coating systems. High pressure airless system. Liquid is pumped at high pressure, 250 to 3000 pounds per square inch gauge, through a small orifice, 0.009 inch to 0.020 inch it, in the fluid nozzle which results in finally divided spray. The degree of atomization is controlled by the fluid pressure, the orifice size and the viscosity of the liquid. Because of the small orifice, suspended solids in the coating composition must be finally milled or filtered to prevent orifice blockage. Lower pressure, air atomized system. In this system, liquid is pumped through a larger orifice, 0.020 inch to 0.060 inch it, at relatively low pressure, 5 to 50 sig. Lower pressure air, 10 to 100 sig, contacts the liquid stream at the tip of the atomizer, and finally divided spray is produced. The degree of atomization is controlled by the fluid pressure, the fluid cap orifice, the viscosity of the liquid, air pressure and air cap design. Film coating. Tablet appearance. Retains shape of original core. Small weight increase of 2-3% due to coating material. Logo or brake line is possible. Process. Can be automated for example axle quarter. Easy training operation. Single stage process. Easily adaptable for controlled release allows for functional coatings. Sugar coating. Tablet appearance. Rounded with high degree of polish. Larger weight increase 30-50% due to coating material. Logo or brake liners are possible. Process. Difficult to automate it for example traditional coating pan. Considerable training operation required. Multi-stage process. Not able to be used for controlled release apart from enteric coating. Difference between. Film coating and sugar coating.